Hey, Collider fans, uh, the man right there, Jeff Snyder, has broken an exclusive scoop about Natalie Portman giving out advice twice in a new film coming soon. We're going to talk about that next. All right, Jeff Snyder, this comes from your incredible fingers. Natalie Portman here is going to be possibly portraying Ann Landers and her sister in uh, uh, Dear Abby in a new film coming that she is going to direct as well. Uh, how did you come up with the scoop? Tell me what your reaction to all this is. Uh, it's something I've been tracking for the last uh, week or two. Um, I, I kind of love the idea. Like, if, if you uh, know anything about the, this story, yeah. Ann Landers and Dear Abby, who were like, you know, these gigantic advice columns that everybody was sort of writing in to, to, to figure out their lives and, and get advice, they were sisters. Yeah. Tw identical twin sisters, born in Iowa in 1918. They, uh, they, they worked together on the college school newspaper. I mean, not back mm -hmm. then, not, even, not many women were even going to college. Right. Um, they got married together on, on their 21st birthday. They married two different men. Um, and then and uh, the the older sister Appy, well, the older they're twins, they're the mm -hmm. same age. <laughs> One sister <laughs> Appy, uh, she became Ann Landers. She sort of took over for the person who had who had died and was running that. Right. Uh, and and uh, her sister Popo, as she was called, Pauline, Popo. was yeah. helping her out from time to time. And then you know, uh, Pauline was like, you know, I'm going to start my own column, Dear right. Abby. And then like you know, she went to their hometown and uh, to try to get like the Dear Abby. Uh, column in instead of the Ann Landers column. She made oh, wow. it cheaper. So she kind of undercut her own sister and, and it created this whole sibling rivalry. So Oof. the idea of Natalie Portman playing these two si twin sisters who are, who are feuding and getting to direct herself in, in, you know, at the same time mm -hmm. is I think a really in, unique challenge for Natalie Portman who probably needs a challenge at this point in her career. Yeah, well, I mean, she was recently nominated for Jackie and before that she was nominated earlier for Closer. She previously wrote, directed and starred in an Israeli drama called A Tale of Love and Darkness. Oh, so she right. does, she does does have experience behind the camera so this will be a fun uh i think this is going to be a fun film to explore because you know there's going to be interesting back and forth we saw tilda swinton do this in uh the recent coen brothers movie uh what was it? hail caesar hail right. caesar she played two separate and essentially playing loella parsons and who i think whoever else was involved in there that they were they were competing so to have two twin sisters competing and the sibling rivalry aspect of it all and plus setting it in a time period this is very interesting to me i want to see what she can bring to this and who knows she may get herself another nomination for uh, this situation because portraying two different characters can sometimes really uh, right. get you a leg up on the Academy. Right. That's one of those uh, acting exercises yeah. that, that everybody <laughs> wants to do and, and that the Academy seems to really respect. Um, this this project has a, a solid pedigree behind it. It mm -hmm. hails from uh, producer Peter Seraf and Big Beach. They're the company that did Little Miss Sunshine, yeah. Safety Not Guaranteed, Kings of Summer. Uh, so, so, you know, they have a great track record of putting out really interesting, thoughtful mm -hmm. indies. And, you know, if Natalie, if that's what it takes for Natalie Portman to sign on to to play two roles in in the movie to let her direct it yeah. essentially, um, I think you got to I think you got to do that. Yeah. You know, studios aren't really giving her that shot to direct their stuff. You know, mm -hmm. I don't know if the whole mess with Jane got a gun reflected oh, poorly on her because maybe. she was one of the lead producers on that project. Mm -hmm. um, She's, she's going to be working off a script by Katie Robbins, who was a, a staff writer on The Affair in The Last Tycoon. So, yeah, I, I think that there's a lot of um, interesting stuff mm -hmm. to... to to uh, dramatize here, because you know, you, you not only have the two sisters, you have their husbands, you yeah. have their editors. Mm -hmm. It's it's a it's a cool like competitive sibling thing. And I'm curious to see how far out in terms of age the film goes, because they did reconcile in '64, but they still maintain the rivalry until they're passing in 2002. So it never was fully patched up. So right. uh, that will uh, that will be. It, I'll be curious to see how that plays it out. Tri in the movie. It trickled down to the next generation to their, oh. their respective daughters and everything. <laughs> oh. I don't know. The story has a little bit of. of uh, the movie Colette in it, that Keira oh, yeah. Knightley movie that, that's coming up. It's got a little bit of adaptation in it, I yeah. think, with like the, the oh, feuding right. siblings. Right, with Nicolas Cage. Yeah, yeah so uh, it, it's an interesting indie, and and I thought, uh, you know, we, we can't just be reporting on Marvel and Star Wars stuff here at Collider. We want to <laughs> uh, write about movies that are for everybody, and uh, yeah, I well, think this is cool indie news. John. Natalie Portman was in Star Wars, so it kind of works in that way. Uh, all right, let us know what you think. Do you like Natalie Portman doing these dual roles uh, in this film? Do you like her stepping behind the camera to do it? Is it a incredible challenge and task for her. Do you look forward to see what the film will end up being? Let us know in the comments section below. Remember to like and share this video on your social media and subscribe to Collider for more news videos just like this. For Jeff Snyder, I'm John Roca. We'll talk to you soon.